Hello, my Hugh Club. My name is Hugh Diggy. And we are unboxing Wrestle Crate. So I'm just going to look for something to cut it with. I'm going to use this fork. It's an old fork. Don't know why it's still here. Here we go. I'm going to cut it in here. Let's say down here. There we go. As easy as that. Right, two shots. Right, we're going to move the shots out the way. We're going to put them here on top of the DVDs. This is a belt, not a badge. The big gold belt badge. This is WCW and I think it's former NWA title. I don't know. The big gold belt, the, the World Heavyweight, WCW World Heavyweight Championship. Big gold belt. That's quite cool. I'm watching, I'm re watching the Ruthless Aggression era, so it's quite, quite good. We've got a, a lanyard here. And the shades, oh yeah. Oh yeah. I like it. Right, two DVDs, we're going to keep them until after. Come on, I need it out without scratching it. I've got two print like things here. Oh yes, portrait of Mark Andrews. And if you know Mark Andrews, he's a F former FNN shooting star champion. So let me just read a bit on the back here. This pro portrait of a wrestler. This project was conceived by photographer James Musselwhite to showcase athletes and performers of flourishing UK independent wrestling scene. With an emphasis on character storytelling impact, these represent the renaissance of the UK wrestling scene. Mark Andrews is a high flyer, famous for defend indie wrestling and winning. Impact Wrestling British Boot Camp 2, even though they didn't a day much with him, which was kind of disappointing. So that's gone in the autograph collection. We're going to put you behind there. And the next autograph is a bit. Oh, my address nearly gets seen. No arm fucking dark. Sorry, I've tweeted about Norm Dog quite a lot because he is in the CWC the Classic Cruiserweight seat, the Cruiserweight Classic, or the Global Cruiserweight Classic Tournament, you know what I mean. And I think he's the only Scottish guy in it, and I'm telling you, he's gonna fucking win it. The Judai Knight is gonna win it. So, Norm Dog, two autographs for two guys. The I keep tweeting about because I'm a sad bastard. Then we have ROH Global Wars. May 2015. It's got Shinsuke Nakamura, AJ Styles, Jay Briscoe. Oh, it's got everyone. Jay Lethal versus NATO. Harisho Tanahashi versus Mike Welgan. That's going to be a fucking bro match. 10 man tag team match main event ACH vs Shinsuke Nakamura Donovan Dijak vs Dalton Castle Didn't know that happened Oh That's a match worth watching The Kingdom who's Adam Cole and I assume it's gonna be Mike Bennett since Maria Canellis is there vs Matt Seidel and Jushin Thunder Liger Fucking worth it. We've got a Pro Wrestling Chaos DVD, which is a British indie company. You've got Jay Lethal, El Ligero, Drew Galloway, and I think it's Timothy Thatcher. Don't quote me on that because no, it may be Jay Gallagher. 
because honestly, I'm not too big on the English British wrestling scene. I don't know a lot of the names. I know some of them, but I don't know a lot of them. I'm big on the score. Like, I'm no big. I'm big watching it. Mark Andrews versus Jay Lethal. Drew Galloway versus Eddie Dennis for the TNA World Heavyweight Championship. King of Chaos Tables match. The Wild Boar versus Jekyll with Pariah Khan. Or Pariah Khan or Pariah. I don't know. April 2016, so it's like three months ago. I don't know. Is it three months? I need, I need to check because uh, I fucked up now. Uh, one, two months ago. Jesus. Jesus, fuck. Uh, basically three months because judging for the time of it. So we're going to shut this down here. And we're going to get in to the first shot. It's a blue shot. There's a lot of blue shots. But, we're gonna get into the news. I ain't keen stuff up. I think they might have gave me the wrong size again, but it happens. Oh, oh yes. Mark Andrews. Yes. Now I can blab about him on Friday Night Nexus. If he ever returns from injury. Mark Andrews, skateboard, since he does a lot of skateboard spots in Chikiara. And one in TNA, I'm sure. Just a second. Now you get a plastic wrap. And we have one more shirt. There we go. Let's get this up. The summer of 92, Canada champion versus the great... British challenger live from London, England. Bret Hart versus the British Bulldog referring to SummerSlam 92 which was hosted in Wembley Stadium. Which is the only British big, no the only big four that was ever hosted in Britain. Like because we had Rebellion and Insurrection that was hosted in Britain. But, I'm sure SummerSlam 92 was the only big four that was hosted in the Greater Britain area. So I, I like Dressel Create this year, this month, this year. Ah. I really like the Mark Andrews portrait because it, it really does showcase his emotion. It gives a good description about it. Even his uh, the emails in the back, so I can go by email. That is quite quite the class, and I like the shots. The shots are nice, but I might need to go email WrestleCrate to get it up to size, just because I'm a big bastard. But aye, if he's enjoyed, strike that like button, subscribe to join the Heel Club. And my name is Hugh Diggy and I am signing off.